Well, there's a new exhibition at the Toledo Museum of Art that transports you to the middle of a garden. It's called Community, and it's the work of an English artist named Rebecca Louise Law. Now, her work can be seen all over the world, but the Toledo insta installation, that is, is her largest creation to date. 13 ABC's Lisa Guyton takes you inside the one-of-a-kind exhibit in tonight's art scene. Community is made up of hundreds of thousands of flowers, all different shapes, sizes, colors, and varieties. Some of the flowers were even grown right here in the Toledo area, and a lot of local people had a hand in helping bring this installation to life. This may not be what you'd expect to find inside one of the galleries here at the museum. So over 500,000 flowers in this space. And all those flowers were strung together by hand. It's a really different experience, you know, it's all immersive, it's all sensory, and so you really get to enjoy it on a number of different levels when you come here. You know, the pictures and the images are beautiful, but it really doesn't speak to what it's like to stand in here and feel completely enveloped in a field of flowers suspended from the ceiling. Rebecca Louise Law is a staunch supporter of sustainability, so some of the flowers here were repurposed from other installations she's created around the world. It's a really special gift to the city of Toledo. We're very honored to have it here at the museum. And this installation is truly a community project. We engaged hundreds of volunteers and we grew hundreds and thousands of flowers here in Toledo. And then uh, the volunteers worked to string those flowers and incorporate them into the exhibition. And then those plants were replanted around Toledo. The flowers are in a semi-dried state. For a number of the flowers, they actually went through a flash freezing process uh, where they're put into a freezer and then brought down to a certain temperature so they're safe to come into the museum and they're not bringing any uh, unwanted wildlife with them. And one visit to this gallery garden may not be enough. As the flowers continue to dry, you have a slightly different experience. And it's also something wonderful to share with your family and friends. We've really noticed people having a strong connection, uh, you know, grandparents bringing their grandkids here, people coming on dates. And so that's really wonderful to see. This exhibition is part of the museum's ongoing effort to bring different art to life within its walls. For a lot of people, it's pushing the boundaries of what they consider art. But when you think about art as something that evokes emotion and evokes memory and takes you on a journey, it's absolutely all of those things. The community exhibition is here at the museum through January 13th. It is free for museum members. There's a small charge for non-members, but there are all kinds of different discounts being offered. We've posted a link at 13abc.com. With today's art scene, I'm Lisa Guyton, 13ABC, Action News. That is gorgeous. Very cool.